So just the other day while working in another project, I came across something that I felt was intended for one thing, but end up working for something else. And it's actually something that, uh, man, this is something I've been looking for for, for a long time. Um, I, I like to keep my, my sessions organized as far as the name. You know, I, I like every, tra every track to have the name and reflect the, 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 the region name and, you know, that type of thing. So um, I'm going to show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. And, and this is this is something I thought that I thought was was very, very cool. <laughs> I don't know if it's something I discovered, it, it, you know. I don't know if it's something that's already in the books, but it's certainly something that I did not find when searching for this. And the fact I've, I've uh, you know, spoke with a few guys over over forums and, th and different things like that and nothing. You know, it was always, well, you know, something I didn't want to hear. But basically, this is... Um, this is... Uh, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. Just... just Check this out. All right, don't judge me. Something very simple just for the sake of this video. And let's pull in something else totally different. And let's go to some drums. And I was playing around with these drums early. And I was like, wow, these, is, these drums sounds pretty good. I don't I don't recall ever playing with these whatever for the sake of the video we're just gonna keep it rolling right two three four all right we're gonna throw a third one on there and let's see Whatever, right? You get the point. Quantize however you need to. Um, but, you know, just showing you guys something real simple and quick. But um, this is what I thought was pretty cool, right? Say I go ahead and label this, right? I'm gonna label that as synth. And that's drums. And I don't know. What was that? Lead. Some type please sound right, whatever. All right, so I labeled all of my tracks, and as you can see down here in my mix window, everything's labeled properly like I want to. Okay, we're we're on the roll of uh, organ organized. You know, everything's looking good, cool. But my region does not reflect the name I just gave it. All right, something inside of Studio One that is intended for joining or merging tracks together i thought was pretty unique and i you know even if you don't have a track that you want to merge you can actually use it to relabel or rename your tracks so basically what i'm going to do here is select all and hit g because i have g as my key command for merging or you can also achieve this by right clicking and going to your merge events here it's the same thing and if you want to set your key to a command you know inside here you can do so as well but um mine's g and um i have my reasons <laughs> uh mine's g because it was uh g was a uh, glue tool inside of logic pro x and so i just kind of kept that whole that whole thing so you kind of get my point so now everything says okay this is drums this is synth this is lead this is what i'm looking for instead of relabeling you know going here and actually you know so say say for instance i say uh, um i don't know just lead two or something like that you know when i change it here it doesn't change here all right so just hit the you know the merge and, and it reflects you know but I don't think you can achieve this working with audio, okay? So that might be something <laughs> that, you know, I don't I don't like that because I work with audio a lot as well. But um, this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. I, I'll take this. I, I'll, I'll take it, you know, no problem. So, 
All right, I hope you guys enjoyed what I had to show you. That's all I want to show you guys. Remember, at the end of the day, music is art. You're the artist. Paint your picture.